Hello everyone, I'm Harry. Welcome back to King Kun San Classroom. Firstly, please allow me to introduce a new friend, Miss Arlene. She has been working in the registration department of King Kun San for more than three years. Hello Arlene, please say hello to everybody in the classroom. Thank you, Harry. Hello everyone. I'm Arlene from King Kun San. Uh, okay, today we'll continue to talk about the sucking pest control. Arlene, do you remember during the last class, Ria has mentioned that uh, there was a special kind of sucking pest that cannot be controlled uh, by the common insecticide? Yes, of course. It is spider mites. Spider mites are members of the botanic family, which includes over 1,600 species. They are part of the subclass Acri. Due to their eight legs rather than six, they are not insects. So, the common insecticides are not effective on them. Spider mites are major pests worldwide that are causing serious damage to many plants and great economic losses in agriculture and horticulture. Spider mites are known to feed on several hundred species of plants. Uh, since uh, spider mites are very destructive pests in agriculture and horticulture, as I know, uh, spider mites are tiny and very difficult to recognize. So how to identify the signs of infestation from the spider mites on our crops? There are three key signs of the spider mite infestation. Number one, tiny white and yellow spots on the top of the plant leaves or needles. Number two, silky webs woven around plant leaves and the stems. Number three, a yellow or brown appearance in one or many areas of, of the plant. This happens when having infestation. If you suspect spider mites have invaded your plant but want to know for sure, hold a sheet of paper under a plant or a branch and lightly shake it. The spider mites will fall up and look like speckles on the paper. Thanks, Arlene. Uh, during working in our field efficacy test center, I have seen the red spider mites and two spotted spider mites. They attack and feed on the crops and also cause uh, crops to become sensitive to diseases and other issues. Yes, Harry, the red spider mites and two spotted spider mites are the common species. The adult spider mites can be red, orange, yellow, green, white, or brown in color. They have needle-like sucking mouth parts and feed by the penetrating the plant tissue and the sucking out the contents. The infested leaves will turn yellow, wilt, drop off, and eventually the whole plant may die. Large population of leaves and adults can even cover entire plants with their webs. Mm -hmm. Uh, as I know, spider mites typically develop uh, through five stages, egg larvae, two nymphal stages, and adults. Different from Lepidoptera insects, spider mites have nymphal stage uh, instead of the pupa stage. Most mite species overwinter as eggs on the leaves and the bark of host plants. In early spring, as temperatures warm, tiny six-legged larvae began hatching and uh, feed for a few days before seeking shelter where they molt into the first nymphal stage. Nymphs have eight legs and pass through uh, two more molts before becoming mature adults. After mating, the female continuously produces as many as 300 eggs over a couple of weeks. Hot dry weather favors rapid uh, development of these pests. During such conditions, the time it takes to pass from egg to adult may occur in uh, as little as five days. There are several overlapping generations per year. Yes, spider mites thrive in hot, dry conditions. Due to their small size, difficult to recognize the signs of infestation, rapid reproduction, time-consuming, limited availability of effective uh, caricides, and the costly management as well as an environmental concern.
five months resistance against the available uh, carousels have been even more challenging for spider mites management. Uh, yes, Arlene. So how to get rid of spider mites? Do we have uh, good solutions? For a long time, people have mainly and widely relying on chemical pesticides to control spider mites. However, most of insecticides are not effective, and the spider mites are well known for their capacity to develop resistance regularly to chemical control. So in the market, it's very difficult to find the suitable uh, carousel products without a standing effect on spider mites. Kings mites from King Kong Sun is an ideal uh, carousel for Excellent control for all life stages at spider mites, including eggs, larvae, leaves, and adults. King's mites provides extra advantages, including efficacy stability when temperature changes, high efficacy in low dosage, safe to the whole growing period of crops no cross resistance to the current acaricides. Reduce the photolysis as the active ingredient, good solubility and penetrability, compatible with most pesticides. By the results of King's Myself in field trial tests, we have received many feedback of the outstanding efficacy. The Chinese Academy of Agriculture Science conducted the trial test of King's Myself on citrus. King's Myself provides a 98% death rate of spider mites in one day after application, 99% death rate in three days, and 100% death rate in 10 days. The 100% death rate efficacy can last for 30 days. On peach trees, King's Myself provides 85% death rate of spider mites in one day after application, and 100% death rate in three days. When 10 days after application, spider mites were still invisible. The infested leaves turned green, and the backside of the leaves were very clean. We also tested the efficacy of the spider mites control results on rose garden. Due to living and hiding in rose flowers, spider mites on roses are very hard to control. From the test result of King's Myself, we can see that before application, there were abundant leaf spider mites on roses. One day after application, only few alive spider mites before application, spider mites adults are very active. After application, spider mites are dead. Before application, the rose garden was highly infested by spider mites. Only 10 days after application, the rose garden became clean and fresh. Many new leaves growing, so we can recommend kids myself proudly as an ideal of caricide for spider mites control. Okay, thank you Arlene. All right then, uh, this is all for today and hope this video can help you have a new understanding of the spider mite control. If you like it, please subscribe to our channel. And if you have any more questions regarding to spider mite control, please leave us a message down here below in the comment zone and King Kwon will try to provide you with more information regarding to the pesticide industry and pest control. King Kwon focus, focus on, on your, your harvest. harvest.